Today I'm going to show you how you can set up your Wix boards in the Media Manager to easily access your media files across all your sites. What's up you guys? Thanks for tuning in with your boy Nino and I got a tutorial for you guys today on how you can set up your Wix boards, okay? Before you could only just set up folders in your media manager as I shown you in my last video before uh, and I'll put that up in the right hand corner as I speak right now. But before you only had an option to just create folders in your media manager, but now Wix has opened this whole media manager to another level by adding Wix boards, okay? And with these boards, what you can do is you can create account level folders to easily access your media files across all of your sites. And these boards will also allow you to edit and manage the files you regularly need, no matter which site you're working on. And I really, really like that feature. It doesn't even matter if you have a free site or if you have a premium site, okay? Either way, it will show up on that site. So let's go ahead and go back to what I previously did in my other tutorial was show you how you can get to the media manager. So there's multiple ways uh, to get to your media manager, but this is the way I would go. I'll go right here to my media button. I'll click media and then I'll click upload uh, media. Once I click upload media, I will just literally just click this exit button right here because I don't want to upload anything right now. Okay, as you can see, I have my site files. Actually, I have my home right here. My site files, my boards, trash, and then exploring media from Wix, Shutterstock, and Unsplash. So what I will do here is I'll go actually to my boards and I already have stuff here. I already have some boards already made, okay? Now, if I want to dive into one of my boards uh, that I have right here, I can easily do that, okay? And these are boards that are across all of my sites, okay? Whether it's in my favorites, my technology, uh, with my about boards, barbershop boards. I just created these boards real quick and easy for you guys. Uh, just to see what these boards look like. Now it says right here that you can create different boards to keep your files organized and easy to find. I really do enjoy this. And you don't have to click learn more because you can pay attention to this tutorial and I'll give you everything that you need, okay? And if you need to know more, click learn more, okay? Don't be shy to learn all of this information on your own as well. Okay, so I'm going to go ahead and create a new board. My favorites automatically comes with your site, okay? That means that is just your favorites that you want to put for your site, okay? And this is just an automatic board that has been created. Now, if you want, you can come in here and create a new board, okay? It will give you this nice little fancy picture here, uh, and you can actually replace that image with some other image that you want from your Wix Media Manager or from your uh, your computer, okay? So what you can do here, I am not going to replace that, but I will put here, uh, let's see, I'm going to put here email, okay? So this is a board that just deals with email, anything that deals with email. And if I want to add a description, because many people may come onto my site and they'll see this board and they'll be like, what is that board actually for? So I will go in here and say anything that is email related. And you can get more specific with these things here, but this description is just based upon for your knowledge and for other people's knowledge, other site managers that will be on your site as well. All right. Now you have this option to make this available for all your sites and you have an option to not make it available for all your sites. Okay. And if you go to this information button, it'll just tell you exactly what I just said. Now, I think I want to just keep this on this site because I already have multiple uh, boards for all sites, okay? So I'm just gonna keep that toggled off 
and I'm just gonna click create. You can also cancel if you don't want to create a new board, but I'm going to say create. All right, so I created my email board, okay? Now, if you go anywhere inside of Wix Media Manager, you can actually save and bookmark that particular image, that particular vector item, or even uh, other things that may show up like shapes or arrows um, and all sorts of other things that you can put in here. So it's very useful tool. Now let's go ahead and go to unsplash and I'm just going to type in here email. Okay. This is stuff that's email related. Okay. These are the at signs. So I'm going to have that added to my email, uh, Gmail. Okay. The notorious Gmail really appreciate that. And you know, send mail, send a mail. All right. I think I like that. So I'm going to have that added here. Now, as you can see, it shows me right here, the type of uh, image name was, and then where it got saved to. Now, if you wanted to undo that process, all you have to do is come back here, click here and undo that process. Okay. Now, if you don't want to undo that process, then just don't do it. As simple as that. All right. But seriously, if you want to actually undo that process, you got to go back to your boards. Uh, and then you have to go back into email and then you can actually, uh, take that away. So if I want to remove this from the board, I just click this remove from the board icon. Okay. Which is a bookmark icon. So I'll just click that and boom, it's already removed. All right. It tells me that it was removed from email. All right. So now that we have email here, let's go ahead and get some more vector items in here. Okay. So I'm going to go ahead and click off of here. I'm going to click off of here as well. Okay. And I'm just going to add, let's say a vector item. Now how to get to these vectors is going to decorative. Okay. And then you scroll down to vector art. All right. This is where you can go to your featured icons or animal and nature or logos and badges or characters or what have you, or you can just go ahead to all vectors and actually check all of them out. And what you can do here is add these to your board. Okay. So let's see, for instance, like if I go to, uh, objects, right. And I pick out the eight ball and then I put it into my email. I don't really want that into my email. So I'm just going to add that to my favorites. Okay. Because I think that's a favorite of mine It's not really symbolizing what email really stands for and what my description stands for it. I don't think this would be email related, but if I wanted to, I could actually go back to all categories, come up to my search tool, type in email and it will give me email vectors. Okay. The ones that I can actually use for email. All right. So I can easily put these things in here for my email and it's very awesome. I really do like this feature that Wix has to offer. Really? I do. All right. So I showed you that, but now what I'm going to show you is the cross capabilities of where you can work on any type of site you want and you still have the same content there. So I'm going to go right back to my manager. Okay and I'm going to go ahead and go to my board. Now this board I'm going to go to is called technology. All right. Anything related to technology. Now, as you can see, this shows a link right here and this says it's available for all my sites. So I know that this board is for all sites. All right. If it doesn't have that icon up here, that means it's not available for all your sites. Now, if you want it to be available for all your sites, just click these three dot buttons. Okay. You edit your board and then you just make it available for all my sites. All right. And then you just click save. If not click cancel. All right. If you want to delete the board easily, you can come here and say delete board. All right. You can click delete. It'll give you a prompt and then you can actually click delete. So that actually goes away. Now make sure you make the right decision on deleting that. Okay. Uh, you can't go back to trash. I don't think and find that board. Okay. That is not really where your stuff would go. It actually just disappears for, for good. So what you want to do here is, uh, go back to my boards. All right. And create another one. 
all right and then put all of the same exact things that i just put into my email board back into another created board that says email now if we want to just look at technology like i said before we can just open this up now i have a power button i have a work button computer uh settings like i can make all of these into buttons vectors or shapes uh and it actually can be put onto my site because it already recognizes that this is through across all my sites and i can actually put this on my site however i want so let's go ahead and click this and add to the page all right so boom it adds it straight to my page now let me see this real quick i'm just gonna size this down and make it look like uh it was part of the site all right and i'm gonna put that up top boom easy peasy real easy okay i really do like this feature that wix has to offer and also if you head on over to uh another site right say for instance you go to another site mainly my site how about that what do you know i can actually go right back to my media okay i can go to upload media and i will see those same exact ones for those boards that are across my whole entire board and boom you see i have my technology my about boards and my barbershop board all of these boards are across all of my sites so it doesn't matter where i'm at and i really do enjoy this feature so I hope you guys enjoyed this video and definitely give it a shot. I mean, it's definitely simple, easy, and I really do love what Wix had done with this feature. Uh, definitely intuitive, very easy, and straight to the point, okay? If you have any questions, drop it below in the comments. And thank you so much for watching, you guys. If you like this video, hit that like button. Subscribe if you aren't already, and I'll see you in the next video. All right, guys. Ciao.